We were strangling. <laughs> a little bit, but not really, because I got fucking unemployment. I mean, I mean, not for this week, but so now I definitely have to sell some koozies or whatever because I'm missing out on my 600 books. <laughs> They're like, you qualify for $138 a week. Here's your $738 check. <laughs> It's like, I am not going to fucking question that. <laughs> I don't know what's going to happen later, but I'm sure it's not going to come back to haunt us. It's free money. That's what, and then Congress passed that thing that counted independent contractors as small businesses. So I'm a small business now. <laughs> I got to get a small business loan. And it's forgivable if I spend 60% of it on uh, payroll or utilities or rent, but it's, it's all me. So it's all payroll. I think, I don't know. I don't know how it works. They were just like, you want some money? And I was like, mm. and they were like, you gotta pay it back when you, and I was like, da -da 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 -da. we'll talk about that later. I was like, I just wanna see it. <laughs> nah, I did it smart. I got a loan, but then I paid off all my high interest rate shit with it, you know? So now I still owe a bunch of money, but at like 1%. So that's cool. I was paying my, I got like an Apple card like six years ago to buy an iPad, then now somehow I still owe him money. Because uh, I was just like, oh, cool, I have that card and I'll use it for everything. And never pay it off, and so now I owe them like 14 grand or something. I know that's what my mom said when I told her that, too. She made that exact noise. <laughs> you shouldn't have done that. Like, yeah, no shit. I know. I know now. I just I don't know then. So, yeah. Month, they gotta pay like $400, and then every month they're like, Your interest charges are $393. <laughs> cool, I'll just pay off this 14 grand, seven bucks at a time. No big deal. That'll go away at some point, probably. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like it's almost over. I mean, we're getting pretty close. I did. I've, I've had a good couple of months, honestly. Like, I mean, that, that really not a whole lot changed. <laughs> I was basically doing the same thing before all of this started. They were like, hey, just uh, stock up on groceries, don't hang out with anybody, and just watch Netflix all day. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> okay I'll start doing that now. <laughs> it's not what I was already doing, definitely. So are you guys excited to vote? Are you gonna vote? Yeah? Is anybody going on, on the Biden train? All right. That's cool. I'm a pollster for CNN, so it's good that 100% of you just said that you're going to vote for Biden. That's what I heard. Does anybody else's grandma buy way too many milks and then freeze milk? Yeah, my grandma does. Dylan's was having a sale. So we had to stock up. We bought six milks. We saved fucking 81 cents doing that. So, I don't know what we're going to spend that one. It was a good deal. They were like 99 cents for a half gallon. So that's a decent deal. It's usually like three bucks for a gallon. So yeah, 50 cents a gallon. It's like infinite. If we did that a million times, then we just think. <laughs> and you're like, what? You would fucking lose a bunch of money. And have a bunch of milk. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> shirt that I'm selling. I couldn't think of a good thing to put on a shirt, so um, I, just, I think this is it. Yeah, 
I just say shit. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 